guys welcome to the vaccine series part two and today's topic is what do you do before you get your vaccine shot if that's what you choose to do i got five tips for you all right let's get to it tip number one is make sure you understand each vaccine so there were three vaccines that were that were available it was johnson and johnson madeira and Pfizer. Currently, Johnson & Johnson is off the market. So make sure you understand the science. Check out my video, The Science Behind the Vaccine, that goes into how the vaccine was created. Step number two is understand the benefits of um, getting the vaccine. Should you get it? Should you not? What are the benefits? Check out my, my video, Pros and Cons of the Vaccine. Step number three is check your eligibility. Now, for each vaccine shot, there might be different eligibility. For the Pfizer, um, the, it has opened up to 16 and plus. For the Madeira, it is opened up for 18 and above. All right, so make sure you understand your eligibility. Step number four, right? Schedule your appointment. And how do you do that? You can call your, um, your provider and they can help you um, you can also go on the CDC website for the vaccine finder. Um, most Walgreens are providing the vaccine, so you can schedule them there. They are getting more ships, uh, shipment, shipments there. So check that out as well. Um, yeah. So step number five is make plans. So if you, once you got your schedule, you talk to your provider, um, and you know what you're, where you're, um, where you're going, make plans to have someone, someone with you and also plan for to stay there 15, 15 minutes after you take, um, are receiving a shot. All right. And then also make sure you have that, um, support person to make sure they are, um, monitoring you, um, if you have any, um, symptoms even after that you know, where people are checking in. So have that um, support person for you. And tip number six, a bonus tip is keep positive thoughts, all right? When we're going into this pandemic, we've been having a lot of fears. Allowing yourself to um, trust um, and go in with a clear mind. After you do your research and you really understand what you're doing, that'll give you a peace of mind and go in trusting and believing and making sure that you are staying healthy um, overall. And mental health is super important. So make sure you're practicing that. All right, so my name is Venus Washington. You guys stay tuned for the next topic of the series, which is what happens during the shot? What is that like? What what happens when I'm getting a shot? And if you have questions, please send them to my email. Send them to um, the COVID Madison COVID page. Um, and any questions you got, please, I welcome them. And we will get your answers as soon as possible. I post every, every day, every Friday at 9 a.m. All right. Stay tuned. Peace.